So what is going on everybody, it's JediKing98 here, and today I'm going to be going over a project that I've wanted to work on for a long time now, and it's going to be covering all of the classic gobble gums in Black Ops 3 Zombies. Now, I'm going to be making separate videos for the, this one's going to be the classics, there's going to be another one for all of the megas, and then the ones for the DLC gobble gums that we get in the future. Um... So this is basically just going to be covering each of the gobble gums, what they do, and showing off what uh, what they do in game and, and how they work and everything. So I want to make a video just detailing all of those because there's a lot of them and a lot of them can be kind of confusing and kind of just tell you guys which are some of the good ones that you can use and one of some of the ones to avoid because there's a ton of classic ones and there are a ton of mega ones. So before we jump into this video, if you guys want to leave a like, that would be so greatly appreciated. This video took me uh, a while to to get all the footage for all the gobble gums and everything. Um, so it took me some time to get this all together, but leave a like if you can. That'd be greatly appreciated. So thank you guys. Um, and then also before we jump in the video, I want to detail what each of the gobble gums do based on their color. Uh, you have four or five different colors, I believe. There's blue, yellow, green, and purple. There's four of them, yes. So the blue ones are going to be based on rounds, and after a certain amount of rounds, they will expire. The green ones are going to be based on... Um, time and after a certain amount of time they will expire the yellow ones are going to be based on an auto activation based on something you do in the map such as buying a weapon off the wall or buying a perk or just activate it immediately immediately and then the uh, the purple ones are going to be based on your activation you can activate them you can store them and, and keep them and choose when you want to use them so anyway guys let's go ahead and jump right on into this video Alright, so let's jump into the first gobble gum here that we're going to have, and it's going to go ahead and be always done swiftly. And this is active for three full rounds, and it makes you aim quicker and move faster while you're aiming. So it's basically like having a stock and quick draw kind of thing for three rounds. It's pretty nice to have here. As you can see, I'm zooming in really quickly. Uh, it's it's kind of nice. Um, so the next one here is going to be um, Arms Grace, and this auto activates when you die out and then when you respawn. Um, when you spawn back in the next round, you're going to go ahead and respawn with the guns that you had when you died as you see I get my VMP back when I respawn here so the next one here is going to be coagulant and this makes it so that your bleed out time it um, it lasts a lot longer this is active for 20 minutes and when you when you get down and you bleed out it's normally 30 seconds well this one lasts for two whole minutes here I'm speeding it up real fast here um, so now the next one we have here is in plain sight and this is one of the best gobble gums in the game for classics and it, you have two activations and it makes all the zombies ignore you for 10 seconds it's like having a zombie blood from origins basically um, very good gobble gum to have. I highly recommend, it, especially because it's a purple auto active or an activated one. The next one here is going to be stock option, and this is a green gobble gum that lasts for three minutes, and it makes it so that your ammo is taken from your stockpile instead of your magazine, so you don't have to reload here. It's a pretty nice one to have on the early game, um, you know, until you get those later gobble gums through leveling up. So the next one here is going to be impatient, and this makes it so that you will, when you die, when you bleed out, you'll respawn towards the end of a round. As you see, the round didn't change, and I still respawned right there. Pretty nice. Um, I don't recommend it. The next one here is sword flay, which lasts two and a half minutes, and it makes your your melee attacks deal t five times the amount of damage. I believe the Bowie knife is insta kill up until round 25 with this uh, this gobble gum. It's very effective for getting those knife kills for that good XP. It's uh, definitely a highly recommended gobble gum. There. The next one is going to be anywhere but here, and this gives you two activations and allows you to, to teleport to a random location. And if there are any zombies near that location where you teleport, they're going to be blasted away. So the next one here is going to be Danger Closest, which is active for three full rounds and makes you take zero explosive damage. It's a pretty nice gobble gum to have. Um, it can be nice for Dare Eisendraga with the Panzers. So the next one here is going to be um, Armamental Accomplishment, which makes you switch your weapons faster, and also you can throw your um, grenades and stuff faster, your monkey bombs, and you can recover from melee attacks faster, and it's active for three full rounds. So the next one here is going to be Firing on All Cylinders. It's active for three full rounds, and allows you to fire while sprinting here. As you see, I'm running and also firing my VMP at the same time. The next one is going to be... Um, Arsenal Accelerator, which is for 10 minutes, it allows you to charge your special weapon faster. Um, the Annihilator normally takes 50 kills to charge, but with Arsenal Accelerator, it only takes 38 kills to charge. The next one is going to be Lucky Crit, which is active for one round, and it makes it so that your alternate ammo types are active. Um, they activate faster, or they have a better activation. It's it's more likely to happen. I haven't noticed much of a difference with this one, so I highly don't recommend getting this one. It kind of seems like a waste, in my opinion. Um, not one of my favorites, personally. Um, 
So anyway, moving on to the next one here, we have, uh, this is Now You See Me, which is, um, it's a co-op gobble gum to have, and you have two activations, and when you activate it, all zombies are going to chase you for 10 seconds. It's like having a zombie blood that brings all the zombies to you, so if your friend's in a little bit of a struggle, you can just use that, and all the zombies will be pulled off of him, and then go right towards you. It's pretty nice. I haven't found much of a use for it, though. And then the final one, which is the best gobble gum in the game, including all megas and classics, is Alchemical Antithesis and it's basically free max ammo it's infinite ammo it makes it so that for every 10 points that you you use into a zombie uh, that you get it converts it back into one bullet of ammo so you say your gun is getting maybe a hundred points per kill there's 10 bullets of ammo right there for that kill if you melee a zombie one melee is 130 points um, if you use no bullets that's that's 13 bullets that you're getting back into your weapon so with a wonder weapon this is exceptionally amazing because it's they have such low ammo and you're getting it back so quickly so anyway guys that's all the classic gobble gums in this game um if you enjoyed the video like i said leave a like it's be greatly appreciated um i i i, I love that when you guys do that it's great seeing all the likes and all the support and everything that you guys have been doing it's it's just awesome so if you really enjoyed the video you can go ahead and hit that subscribe button and it'll let you see all the con or let you know when i upload all of my content um and also just it helps me out a lot it's it's great seeing all the support so anyway guys thanks for watching this video if it helped you that's great i hope it did i hope it explained all the gobble gums to you and now you know which are the good ones to use and the ones to avoid so thanks for watching guys and i hope to see you in the next one